Oh, don't try to hide, little human. I might be blind, but that does not mean I don't see you. I don't know how you got in here, but there's no reason in hiding. Come on, show yourself. Then I'll decide what I'll do with you. First you break into someone's house, and then you wonder why they try to punish you, hmm? Not very clever things, are you, humans? Oh, no worries, I won't kill you. I promise. That's better, isn't it? Hiding in the shadows. No place for a man thing like you. So fragile. What am I? Well, I'm a faun, of course. A blind one at that. Still, I own a library. Yes, I know. It might sound very funny to you, but... I have found a different way to read. See, I've been blind for a very long time. And I learned myself tricks. Tricks humans will never understand. Wouldn't a better question be where you are, hmm? Manfing? I haven't seen your kind in my realm before. At least not for a very long time. The last girl that was here, well... I wonder what happened to her. A very sweet lady she was. She tried to buy a book of me, but she had no money. But then again, you don't need money in this store. We take different kind of payment. We trade in goods and stories, you see. So why are you here, human? What brings you to my fantastical bookstore, hmm? You're looking for something specific. Well, do tell me more. We have quite a grand collection in here, and in our honesty I do not know where everything lies, but I have a way to find what you need. You must give me a name, however. What are you looking for? What knowledge do you wish to gather? You're looking for a story about an amulet. Oh, there are many stories made around amulets, my dear. I'm afraid you need to be a little more specific. Hmm, like, what material is this amulet made of? Do you know? Well, let me refresh your memory. We have stone, bronze, silver and gold. We have jade, nickel and wood of old. Hmm. Great old silver, you say? Are you sure, little man-thing? Great old silver is very potent and magic. And I believe a little thing like yourself shouldn't be squabbling with magical objects. They are very dangerous, even for I. And I am old and wise, and I've seen things that new will never see. Believe me when I say this. You want to stay away from those amulets. But, if you are willing to trade a little memory of yourself for the knowledge that you wish, I'd be willing to make the trade. After all, whatever you do with it is not my responsibility. Still, be warned. Cradled silver belongs to dark powers. It was formed by them once, and it shall be used by them again. It is not pure evil, but very potent with darkness. Now that you have been warned, let's start a trade, shall we? If you wouldn't mind. May I touch your forehead? Well, I need to see what kind of memories you have in store for me, so that we may trade one, hmm? Oh, of course, let me explain how it works. So, I will be taking one memory from you and turn it into a great book. Then that book will be for sale in this beautiful store. And until someone buys it, it shall stay here, well hidden. However, if I take that memory, it shall be out of your... It shall be away from you forever, and unless you wish to trade it with another memory, you won't be getting it back. That's how this bookstore functions, my dear. Are you still willing to make this trade? Hmm, well then, let me touch your forehead, shall we? Let's see what you have in store for me. Oh, many good memories, I see. I always liked those. 
However, I need something useful. This whole book sell best. I don't need any fiction or drama. No, that does not work for me. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. I shall be taking that one. I don't have to tell you which memory I'm going to take, do I? It might make it a little simpler with forgetting it. Hmm? Do you wish to make this trade? You do? Very, very good. Then let me take the memory away from you. Let me just start the incantations. And before you know it, you won't remember what you missed. Now let's start. Before I start, though, are you completely certain? There is no refund or anything like that. Once it's gone, it'll be always gone from your memory. Whatever it might be. Well, in that case, let me start. I stole I rook. I see why crook. I see show rook. I came stay back. I see shack. There we go. Your memory's gone and has been turned into this little book. One day it might help someone, like you are being helped right now. But, who knows, maybe it shall be hidden in this bookstore forever. Some memories just cannot be sold. Too precious. Anyways, let's start our arrangement. Now did I have what I want? Let me give you what you want, hmm? Hmm, let's see if I can find it. Hmm. That's not it. And that's not it. No, not at all. Ah, here we go. And here it is. A book about cradled silver amulets. Now be careful when reading this. It is a very complex book. You see, my books aren't like the books that you may know. Once you open it and you read it, you feel the emotions of the writer. After all, this is a memory. So, be warned. As I said, cradled silver is potent in dark magic. You never know who wrote this book. It might be a dark magician for all you know. Just be careful. Now, off you go. You've got what you wanted. And I have many things to do in this house, so, shoo. Back to your own world, eh? There we go. Finally some rest and peace.